I was injured by one of those exploding cell phones. <laughs> not, a, uh, yeah. not the idea that the companies had. My hands and cheek were burned. What do I do now? And boy, that has been in the news a lot lately. It has. In fact, I saw where some of the airlines <laughs> won't let you take a certain <laughs> phone on, <laughs> on, on the, even in the carry-on. Well, again, if, he's, if he said he burns his hands and his cheeks or whatever now, okay, if he's an artist and he can't paint, he's a famous artist, right. he's got a great case. If, on the other hand, he's just got some scarring and he's, you know, his lawyer, it, he probably it does not have a case. It doesn't affect his livelihood. See, that, that's, again, it's a product liability question. If he gets into a class, that's different. He gets some money, won't get a lot, but he'll get some. But unless he's really injured, no lawyer's going to take a product liability case. At this point, now that these have been in the news, people are generally aware of these problems. A lot of companies have recalled these sure. devices, these batteries. Does that significantly damage somebody's chances of, of having a case? Not really. A recall actually helps your case because hmm. the, the company's basically saying, we know we messed up. Right. See, so we're, we want them back. Now, they can have a defense if they notify you two or three times and you don't send it back in to have it repaired, okay. like on a car. Sure. And then you get injured and you say, oh, you have a... You know, you had a recall, and they go, right, and you didn't honor it. Well, and I may be mistaken about this, but I think I've gotten a letter in the mail saying, this product uh, on your vehicle is being recalled, but don't bring it to us yet. We'll tell you when to bring wow. it to us. That's and, dangerous for the company. Well, and to me, that said, they had a lot. It was a big recall, sure. I remember. But uh, is that something you hear of? We'll let you know when we have the, the availability to do Every this. Every now and then, and not too often, because once they send that letter out, you're on notice, mm -hmm. and a lot of folks run to the lawyer or, you know, they, they want to get a, to be a member of a class. With the Internet now, you can find class actions. See, that's the problem. Used right. to, Farmer John sat out there, and he didn't know. But now, you get on there and Google it, and you can, there may be a class in Knoxville, Tennessee you can join.